another week in my life vlog. I just got dressed. I cold plunged and I feel very alive. Today's been a very productive morning. I got some work done. I went on the walk. I cold plunged and all the things. Ignore all of this. I still haven't figured out what I'm going to do with my bedroom and this dresser when I'm putting up here. I just, I don't know. I really want wallpaper, but you know, we'll get there eventually. These earrings, guys, I think these are fun. Like, if you're dressing them up, like, super cute. They're, like, $12 on Amazon. And then this sweater is, I think, like, 30 bucks on Amazon. It's a little long, I will say. Like, I wish it was, like, a little bit cropped. But, like, still very cute. Very on trend, I feel. Very Christmassy today. It's time to get some stuff done. I listened to the How to Connect Your Life podcast from Ed Milet today for the third time. Like, I love it. <laughs> Okay, guys, I was watching the canceled podcast. Macy, you know what? I would like if we just started consuming the same content. Besides, I know. Japan, so we have no common ground. I know. That's where our, our age gap really shows. I tried to start reading. I, I know. Well, you've really done that, but I was listening. It's Chris Olsen and Megan Trainer. Oh, I would actually like this. You would, and they're talking about all the content they consume and everything, and I'm like, that's me. Like, I, I know everything they're talking yeah. about. But I just don't have and someone to Here's talk the thing about. is like I know all this content from TikTok clips, mm -hmm. but not in depth. Like I know exactly yeah. everything that's going on. I'm more of like a YouTube person, so like I know, I know all the YouTube you stuff, you know? Anyways. Okay. Macy said she got me a gift. Also, guys, I just want to say, okay. I know you would never judge me, but I am awaiting a glow up right now. Um, I have to wash my hair, but I'm having like a full glow up, so if you guys want that routine, let me know. <laughs> I ordered pimple patches, I'm dyeing my eyebrows, oh, okay. Wow. Whenever I come to Kenzie's, I like don't really have a cup. Like, when I'm always just filling up water in random cups and I kind of feel bad. And so I saw these on TikTok shop. Cute! And I just thought that you could benefit from having, like, they're the perfect size. Mm -hmm. Like, iced coffee, water. Like, look how cute these cute. are. You got one for me and one for you. Yeah, but they're gonna be kept here. Yeah, perfect. Because I have cups at my house. Wow. But like look how cute these are. Like imagine just those. like like how fun. No, it is so cute. I literally bought them from TikTok shop because I was like driving home from Kenzie's and I was like, oh, I need to get a cup there because I always like I never think to bring my Stanley because I'm like, that's so heavy and I'm always like bringing stuff over here. I'm, yeah. Like, no, so honestly, having something that isn't a Stanley though. I know. You know, I love my Stanley is my home cup. Like look how cute these yeah. are. Can I be like. Oh, just fill up my water and like they still fit your aesthetic. No, it's so cute. You did such a good job. And you Thank know you. you know how I feel about a glass straw. I know. Wow. So, these are my Kenzie's house cups. Wow. Well, but if I come I over. I love them. If I come over and, and it's like, not someone, for you. No, and someone else is like using the cup. I'm like, going to be like. You know, like Tim or Tim or Tim? I'm like. <laughs> Where'd you find that cup? I'm like, where'd you get that? <laughs> I'm like, I bought that. I'll take that. Thank no, you. like, I'll give a gift, but I'll make sure you remember who gave it to you. Oh my god. And don't worry, I'm gonna take this box home because I need to reuse. It's the era of reusing, not gifts, but like gift packaging. Totally. So. No, actually, keep every box PSA. Um, keep all of your boxes right now to wrap your gifts in. Yes. Because then you're just gonna be screwed. Like, for example, I have a sweater to wrap and I don't have a box, and I've recycled all my boxes. X Max is smell it. When, when we fell apart. Oh my god, I'm reading Kenzie's emails. You guys will not believe what I'm seeing right now. It's an Urban Outfitters <laughs> partnership, guys. <laughs> it just is an offer. It's not even actually a deal. Wait, I need to tell them. What? My health issues. <gasps> guys, this is huge because I've been so concerned about Macy's yeah, health issues. So, um, I am known to have their, like just ailments. Like I'm always like so many. I'm not always complaining about something, but like I'm in pain a lot, and it's just random. Something is always off. Like nothing's ever a hundred percent with me, and I <laughs> for for like okay. So I went to the dentist yesterday, and I was like, I have really bad jaw pain. Like I wake up every day, I'm going like this. I'm massaging myself twenty four seven. Like my jaws always hurt. And I told the dentist, and he was like, and I told him I was like, everyone says that it's from grinding your teeth, but I don't think I grind my teeth. He did a breath airway test on me to like 
see how I breathe throughout the night. Yeah. Turns out my tongue like literally blocks my airway and I clench so hard while I sleep just to get a breath. And I have disordered, sleep disordered breathing. And it's causing so many ailments because I don't breathe when I sleep. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, guys, like, my jogging. If you have like health issues all the time, look into that. Like you might have that, like my jaw pain, my trouble falling asleep, my focus issues. Like turns out I didn't have enough oxygen in my brain. That makes so much sense. So, so much sense. <laughs> so like it's all coming together. together. <laughs> I literally didn't have oxygen. Okay. <laughs> like these people are like, okay, we don't care about your health issues, but like I do. No, we care. I'm just drinking my iced coffee, getting some work done. You guys, I got an infrared sauna that's coming very soon. I'm very excited. I did tell them yesterday, but I was vlogging yesterday and then yesterday afternoon, something just hit me. Like I had the most anxiety I've had in so oh, no. long. But actually, no, I'm lying. Something didn't hit me. I drank too much coffee. That's what happened. And then my mom came over and we were setting up my new garden bed. We were setting up my new, I got a closet organizer, all this stuff. And like, I literally thought I was gonna have a heart attack. Yesterday? Yeah. Oh, my door dash order's calling. Hello? All right. This thing, you know how I feel about it. Yeah. It's everything ever. <laughs> Don't mind me. Um, I got rid of my dead plants too. I kind of like having leaves everywhere because it feels like fall. Wow, I wonder what you're working on. That is, don't tell them. <laughs> I just look over and that's what she's written. <laughs> Hi y'all. Oh, sorry. Want a big Cody Johnson K. Guys, I'm in my new truck for the week. I wish it was mine for good. Um, GMC gave me a truck and I just feel so amazing. I've been wanting it. I actually like really do want a truck. Life with a truck is just better and it would make my life a lot easier. Like I would in a hundred, in like two seconds trade in my car for a truck. And, like look at how stunning the interior of this is. It feels, I mean, it is so nice. I'm getting used to driving it right now. I love the colorway. I mean, oh my gosh. Thank you so much to GMC. Like, oh, amazing. On Thursday, we're gardening. We're going to get rid of a bunch of stuff in my garage because I have a sauna coming and we're doing garage makeover. I need to get rid of boxes. Like I just, as a homeowner and a girl in Texas, I need a truck. Um, anyways, I'm picking up Macy. I know we're literally always together. We do literally everything together. So anyways We have a hello We have a holiday bucket list and We're doing things from our holiday bucket list every single week so that we're having a very festive Christmas tonight We're going to Starbucks to get hot chocolate and we're gonna go look at Christmas things and we're doing an Amazon return of mine Woo! You know how to do returns? <laughs> Yes, <laughs> I do. Okay, return mates wouldn't pick this one up. So oh, that's what I was asking. Like, yeah. return mates. Um, wait, guys, do you remember last year's vlog when we got hot chocolates? <gasps> oh, wow, that's so cute. I know. Here's a little. I love up. this car. No, isn't it? Like, so, the interior is so This sick. is exactly my dad's car, but he oh, has really? a little bit of a more, like, bigger one. Yeah. Like, this looks like a little it's like a cute like little I, version of it and i feel so safe and like protected in my dad's truck yeah i love this interior this is like the kind of i want like a brown you know me i want like a brown and black vibe oh my god it's so stunning so i want it i know i do too I want oh the lights it's so magical we should risk it <laughs> okay, what is it? <laughs> is it gonna man mansplaining how to park? Guys, <laughs> we just have the most Guys, Oh, have... there they are, I think. No, maybe not. No, that's, that's valet. These police officers literally just explain. They're not real police officers, by the Sorry, way. Like security, parking, tenders. Yeah, like Highland Park, maybe. Like, <laughs> like parking lot, please. That was probably the most action they've gotten in a while. No, like, oh, I hear him. <laughs> oh, he's talking to other people. <laughs> okay, like I was pulling in. I was parking the truck and I had to like back up and then park so it was like a little close and I was close to the car but I was watching and doing really slowly and then he comes and he literally mansplains how to park for the next like 10 minutes he has people stopped he's holy I mean it was just so bad it was so bad so anyways um off to Starbucks because apparently this one's closing you got that normal spot. no god forbid I just parked there okay <laughs> it was so 
so bad. And then Macy was getting angry. She was gonna like throw a temper tantrum. <laughs> Wow. Merry Christmas. Wow. Mm. We were hardcore we, pouting. No, we were like, oh my god, Starbucks is leaving. No. Starbucks is like leaving and we're like, what's replacing it? Ralph's coffee. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Bye, girl. Bye. We'll miss you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Leave. That was kind of crazy when I wanted to do that. Well, Merry Christmas! First they man swam parking to us. Now we're literally sitting guys. Here doing this. It was insane. We're not past it. We're like still. Turn the wheel. No, the other way. Like I, I felt like I, was, I felt like I was at the DMV again. Like in fifteen. My when favorite I was thing is when you get mad because it's so rare. But when <laughs> you do, it's like. But it's not, and it's a different kind of mad. mad. No, it's like a. <laughs> no, it's like a tip for tantrum. Like, it, like when we say, "Oh, when we throwing a tantrum again." Like, we're not getting. But like, I literally was shriveling up in a ball. Yeah, and I was like, I had to be like, I don't but have a choice. That was, it's gonna that be was mad mixed with overstimulated yeah. because it's two police officers yelling opposite things with the car, a and line of cars, cars waiting, <laughs> and I literally was like. I literally want to like run away. Like I, I, I my Dallas away. girls will understand how awful that is in this in this parking lot. And look, oh, oh, uh, the car got out fine. It's a new car now. No, no, it's actually a new car. But oh. it, still, I'm gonna get in and out of this car just fine. It was crazy. Anyways, we're gonna go look at Christmas lights. Oh my god, I just am so happy. Wait, I need to do an interpreter dance. Okay. <laughs> to say goodbye to Starbucks. <laughs> What song it was a really a heartfelt goodbye, but once we figured out Ralph was coming, I was like, bye. bye. It's like when you're like sad about a boy and then you yeah. get a better one. <laughs> Literally. Okay, what dance should I do? I just like okay. need you guys to see. Hanging out with us is exactly what you'd expect. She's having me hold the front camera. Let me see, that was so good. I wish I could have seen it. I mean, where did that come from? Like, Missy, that was incredible. I'm not kidding the guy. I actually think you're a good dancer. <laughs> like, I'm so okay, serious. more. Wait, at least draft that. I drafted it. Okay, I'm I gonna... always do. Okay, like, just so you guys can, like, hopefully get this. Oh, wait, there's so many cars. I have to stop. Guys. No, like, you perform better under pressure. Like, how do I explain? Like, no, we can't give you this parking lot. My friend is dancing. <laughs> is dancing. She's doing an at dance. rehearsal. Yeah. That's so good, Macy. It's okay. No, I can't. Macy, there, you there, have After it. this one. Okay. But they want our parking spot, so they're not gonna. No, we're literally looking at the lights. Yeah, look. <laughs> wait, wait, I'm gonna do a TikTok. Do you wanna go look at lights? Yeah, <laughs> sure. They're literally just us. Just <laughs> okay, go. <laughs> I'm dying because there were people literally right there. What do you think you feel? Oh, that one's so good, Macy. Oh my, that <laughs> kick was crazy. Enjoy for the kick. Kick was crazy. That was your. Do I even guess. caption this or no? No caption. No, nothing, the... nothing else is needed. <laughs> like you don't even need music, honestly. They're literally about to hit us with their Porsche. Happy Tuesday. I hope you all are celebrating because it's Dancing with the Stars night. By the way, this is my truck. Okay. I'm so excited about it. Guys, we found the Christmas trees on our festive night that Macy's trying to ditch me for for Dancing with the Stars, even though we've had these plans for a week. So Tuesdays, she'll get there when she gets there. No, 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 I'm, I'm good to take my time, but like you guys know, Tuesdays, especially with the final five left, it's gonna be exciting. Totally. I, I think I'm just more so sad that you're not into the show. I wanna be into it, but I'm too late, it's so okay. next year. So next year. Whoa. Okay, I like the tall ones. It's actually, oh wait, that one. It smells so good. <laughs> Guys, Macy. She just realized Christmas trees are $800. $9.50. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just putting my firewood in my truck bed. Because I have one of those. Oh, oh wait. You're definitely gonna own a truck by like next week. Anyways, seriously, it's so easy. Oh my god, no big deal. Literally, so easy. I can do anything. Easy. Good morning, y'all. I'm on my way to my workout. I have my iced coffee, my Hill House puffer. 
I'm just in such a great mood. We had such a great Christmas night last night. Tonight we're shooting the next card game for a friend of mine, which I will inevitably end up showing you later in this vlog. It's coming out in January, so I'm very excited. We've been working on like restocks for the recipe journal and all this other stuff. I'm very excited. It's 7 a.m., so I'm a little tired. I had a really hard time getting up this morning. I've been getting up at 6 every day, and today was rough. I company was one of the big um, after dinner leaders, and you would know, I've asked, was it his of their time at the level of your life? For the next computer system, you can take a hold of the emotion, embarrassing depression, and it's just All right, y'all, my garden bed. It's ready to go. I'm going to pick up the soil tomorrow. I'm just going to try some bulbs through the winter, and then, obviously actually start gardening later but i got this garden bed from amazon it's six feet so it's actually pretty big it's basically i would say around double the size of the garden beds that i had in my townhouse um but it's very exciting i also have like no idea where that hose even came from i don't know like how else can i make this cute like this side yard i want to turn into a garden high fits so eventually I'll probably just add more beds but like what are other things that I could do I would love to have like a flower garden too I don't know I'm really making use of every single square inch of this house so you guys let me know like what y'all think I'm currently catching up with the gals I was actually just texting Brooke about our plans next week because the girls are coming to Texas I am all ready. I didn't film today because I was working and it was boring. I haven't changed into my outfit yet. I'm waiting for my hair to fall a little bit. Actually, I really want an Olipop. Wouldn't that have been amazing if that was like a brand new? Like, I actually really want an Olipop. No. I actually am just Olipop's number one fan. They've never paid me a dime. They're so good. Okay, drum roll, please. The next product for a friend of mine is our next version of the card game. So these are the nightcap cards. They match the dinner cards. I almost said dinner cap. They're a little bit um, like darker, a little like raunchier. You can obviously play all these cards whenever. It's just a bunch of conversation starters and questions. But I like these to like end off a night, which obviously like a nightcap. Like, would you rather know how you die or when you die? Worst hookup story. The last thing you think about before bed. What's well, relationship looking back you could you could have handled better? Like there's a mix of like funny questions that are a little bit like less appropriate, and then there's a bunch that are um, just like deeper, more thought provoking, and whatnot. I would say you need both card decks. Like we have like craziest drug related story, but we also have like do you believe in fate or free will? You know, they're just. Amazing. You could think of these also as an expansion pack. It's fully like another 59 questions. I think you need both, but I'm so excited. Anyways, these are the things that we're using for the shoot. I have this plate from Bassette. I'm gonna put some like cookies on there. I have these two um, little like tea mugs that I thrifted that we're just gonna put coffee in. And then I have these that I also thrifted that we can put anything in. I don't have stuff to like make espresso martinis. Like the idea of the shoot is like you're coming home from like a night out and you're having a nightcap at home with your friends and like playing this card game. Um, and then we're doing part two of the shoot where two of my guy friends are coming over and we're gonna do like a fire pit shoot with these. So that'll also be fun. Anyways, I'm excited. My outfit that I'm wearing is so cute. It's the Princess Polly one from the last vlog. The like holiday one that I am literally just obsessed with. I'm just so obsessed with this look. Guys, as much as I said when I got this coat, I didn't know if I was like so over the like teddy trend and if I was even gonna wear it. I wear it literally all the time and so many of y'all have bought it. So I don't know what I was thinking. I feel like, yeah, this is my vibe and I'm wearing like real heels, which I never do as we know. But whew, I have my hair up because I put body oil on and I wanted my body oil to dry. But also, what I've been doing to do my hair, which I feel like is like giving it that blowout look that I've been wanting, just been curling it like inwards, and then I just take a clip, and then I hold it up, and I let it sit until it cools down, and then it gives me that like blowout look that I've been looking for. So, 
that works way better for me than blowing out my hair with the Dyson. Like, blowing out my hair with the Dyson has other benefits, but I don't get the exact blowout look that I'm looking for. Like, I just can't do it. I don't know what it is. I think my hair, like, can't do it. I don't know. coffee today is a very big day it's been on my calendar for like a month at this point in about 10 minutes the people from order in your court are coming over and they are organizing my pantry my pantry is so unorganized and awful and ugly um it was organized like it's it started off organized my grandma and i moved my stuff in my mom and my grandma like love organizing i do too it just like takes too long and they love doing it with me, but then it's like a whole day ordeal, and like, I don't, I don't wanna do that, you know? So the people from Order in your court are coming, and they're going to organize my pantry. I already have a lot of things. I'll show you guys it before. Just know it's like really bad, okay? Like it's really, really bad. And like, don't judge me because we've all been there. I just keep throwing things in. Like it's really, really bad. And like all of those glasses really are supposed to go in the hosting closet. There's just like so much alcohol, like it's just really, really, really bad. So when I am a brand new bitch today and everyone's like, oh my God, what got into you? What happened to you? Just know it's because my closet or my pantry is organized. Um, and then I am gonna go through and start organizing my garage more. I've slowly been doing it. We still have boxes and stuff that are not supposed to be in there that haven't been moved from like literally months ago, but there's like nothing I can really do. Um, so uh, I'm gonna get out at least all of the trash just because my sauna is like on its way here. It arrives in like 10 days. So I just wanna like get things going while I have the truck. So that's why I've been waiting. So I'm gonna use the truck for that and then we're gonna go to Home Depot and then I'm gonna get a bunch of soil and stuff for my raised beds and I might get other plans. I don't know. I'm just gonna get basically everything that I possibly can right now because it is my last day i think with the truck at home tonight i'm going to a dallas cowboys game kendra scott invited macy our dallas cowboys cheerleader so i'm going as her plus one which is very exciting um yeah so good morning everyone i really hope that i'm in like a house mood today like in an organization mood i'm not quite there yet but like we're gonna get there you know i think guys say goodbye bye <laughs> I got so much of my garage actually organized and I'm running to Home Depot right now, but I literally cannot get over this truck, guys. Guys, Cody Johnson's new album is so good. I have had it on loop for so long. I'm also obsessed with this truck. I keep saying that. Um, so I just got Smoothie King. It is raining, but it's only gonna get worse throughout the day and it's my last day. Um, so I have to go to Home Depot. I think I'm gonna get some pansies. I'm gonna get some soil. I do need new gardening gloves because my gardening gloves, um, they're, they got rained on and I need to use them today. Got Smoothie King, Angel Food. Remember when I used to always accidentally say Angel Hair for this smoothie? But now I get confused because I'm like, wait, which one was I supposed to say and which one's right? Even though Angel Hair Pasta just feels so right in the world listening to Cody Johnson driving a truck going to Home Depot. Like, this is where I thrive. Also, update. So I've always wanted 
to be like close with my neighbors, but then I had that one neighbor be really mean to me. So then I kind of just hid in my house because I felt like everyone hated me. But then my neighbor across the street and I, we got each other's numbers and I love her. And she's like, I just see you like a daughter. And she's been helping me with so much of stuff. And this is what I wanted. I wanted my neighborhood to feel like a community. So this morning she was helping me with stuff. We were donating things and oh my God, it was just so fabulous. So anyways, oh, I wonder where I should park so that I can put my, I'm gonna move over this way. I will say like parking a truck is very different than parking my normal Evoque. Do you guys think that I should trade my Evoque in and get a truck? And what truck do you think I should get? I personally really like this one. I just think I should, I think it's more practical. And the thing is like, it's not even, I don't even think I would really be saving money. I would love for my car payment to be less, but I don't know, it just feels right. This is my truck by the way. It's so cute, I'll have the details on the screen, but I love it. Y'all, prepare to die. I cannot believe this. First off, it took them only like four hours. I thought it would be like a 12 hour day. Second off, oh my God. It is literally never, ever, ever looked better. Like I'm actually dying. Oh my gosh, even like chia seeds, brown rice. Like, do you know how helpful this is? Quinoa, like this is just so amazing. All of my pastas, my stuff for s'mores. I, that's, it's sweets, but basically I'll have a s'mores. Um, all of my alcohol up here, which is so amazing. Oh my God, you know what? Oh my gosh, guys. I have espresso martini stuff. I could have used that last night. I didn't realize it for the shoot. Dang it. I, think, I actually think On The Rocks is another Dallas brand. Um, oh my god, I'm just so excited. Flour, baking soda, baking powder. Oh my gosh. I mean, they just absolutely crushed it. So, oh my god. I will have their Instagram linked below. I am so excited. Their website or whatever, whatever works, but... Oh my god, guys, like, amazing, they're Dallas-based. If y'all are watching in Dallas, this is just the best thing, especially in the new year. All right, guys, it's later, and I am going to the Cowboys game. Basically got invited by Kendra Scott, so I'm very excited. Of <sighs> very exciting thing, so this is actually pretty much the outfit that I wore to Macy's 100K party. Um, Abercrombie, Abercrombie, Skims t-shirt, my favorite Revolve belt that's only 40 bucks. These, like, anything with, like, a belt buckle, any sort of belt, they just get so expensive, you know? So great price. My favorite Tacobas, these are Josie's, and then I'm bringing this Louis bag. I got on the real real years ago, so I can bring y'all with, because this camera is pretty big. And then just putting on some perfume. I'm gonna drive to Macy's, and then we're gonna Uber to the game. Um, and I'm excited for some snacks. I'm really, I'm really pumped. I'm hoping that they bring Macy onto the field, obviously, because as you guys know, she is a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader, but she does work her well. So this is like her Super Bowl, honestly. It's a really big deal. Okay, Macy, how are you feeling about the game and your performance? It's really weird being up here. Totally, when you're normally down there. Normally, like, down there. Yeah, totally. And to like give back and spend time with, you know, little old me. <laughs> and you would never forget your fans. You want to be one with them. Oh. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. I'm so tired. We went to the Cowboys game last night, and we didn't get home until like 1. And the game 
ended at 10.30. It took forever to get an Uber and then all the cars. We, for some reason, just didn't leave early. Like, we waited the whole game. But anyways, it was really fun. Now, I'm on my way to work out. It's 8.20. So, this weekend is my family's, like, lake trip weekend for Christmas. I vlogged it last year. I still am going back and forth on if I'm going to vlog it this year. I just love having the videos and like memories um but i have so much to do today before i leave hopefully around noon which i don't even know if that's gonna end up being possible guys i'm dying that this is what i look like right now i'm rushing to finish all my things that i need to do before I go to the lake, so I had to wash my hair, get myself a blowout, do all that stuff, which is so time consuming when you have extensions. And I'm currently wrapping my white elephant gifts. Like, listen, normally my white elephant gifts would be my dinner cards, which is the best white elephant gift. Um, but it's my family and they have them. So we're doing Cards Against Humanity Family Edition. I'm so hungry and I don't even know why I'm like putting the pressure on myself to like get there at a certain time because it literally doesn't matter. I'm still gonna be the first one there, but I need to like get work done there before everyone else arrives. I should have, you know, packed and done some things yesterday, but I did it. Anyways, I don't know if I've told you guys yet, I cannot remember, but I have decided on my wrapping paper for Christmas. It's literally just this brown wrapping paper from Amazon and my ribbon from my trees. I got a bunch for um, like 50% off on Black Friday, which is such a good deal. So we're doing that and it looks really cute. I'm sure you guys have probably seen it in the background. Um, it looks really cute by the tree. And I'm literally, okay, this is actually perfect. I'm using, you know when like you just have like a random piece of wrapping paper left? This is, I mean, it's barely not covering in a certain thing, but I'm not being wasteful. The only issue with this wrapping paper is that this tape shows up a ton. And honestly, if it was anyone besides my family, I would, oh, why did I do it this way? Whatever. I would um, be working on covering it better. Sorry, family, but you know, we can see that. It's fine. Look at how cute this Kendra Scott ornament is. I love it so much. That like, oh, this is what I'm wearing right now. Also, I'm just rushing myself for literally no week reason. I'm going to the lake house, but I'm just ready. I do this every time I'm like, have to pack up my car and go somewhere. I actually did this completely wrong and it looks crazy. The thing is it falls and it ends up looking good, but like, it's not even, close to what I was supposed to do. I just put a vest or a coat on and I act like it's, you know, an actual outfit. It's obviously not, but to me it is. I hope you guys aren't getting my stressed out energy. Okay, so I have this vest on and then I don't need to zip it up. I think like that looks worse. And then I just have my Uggs. I'm using this um, away bag as my bag to go and we're off. I'm vlogging this weekend, so keep up. Unbox something before we get off the vlog. Guys, I've been wanting one of these Lucky Loves bags. If you guys have seen them on TikTok or Instagram or whatever for so long, I'm I'm in a rush, as you guys know. Um, so I actually haven't, I didn't tie this right. Like I need to make it look better. But look at how cute the bag is. And then there's just like a big bow. Oh my God, I need every color. This isn't even really the color that I wanted, but they're selling out like crazy right now. But so cute. Oh my gosh, I just love it so much. It says Lucky Loves. This is like my dream friend of mine collab. But like, look at how cute they are. Oh my God, obsessed. So that is it for this week's vlog. I'm about to start the Lake House vlog. It's gonna be a cinematic masterpiece. I hope you guys enjoyed this like chill hangout week in my life vlog. Love y'all so much and I'll see you in the next video.